WRTV's Kelsey Anderson reports on the call to action and how people in Hancock County delivered really big. Take what you need, whether it be hygiene products, food, or clothes, and remember you're loved. That's the message here at the MVMS Care Closet. Shampoo, conditioner, brushes toothbrushes and toothpaste. Whether it's the basic toiletries. We have so many different snacks. Or food to take home. Erin Brown wants to make sure the students at Mount Vernon Middle School have everything they need. Middle school years are probably the toughest years of anyone's life, I would say. Um, and so having that extra piece of security, knowing that they go home and they have food, they have the toiletries they need, they can come to school feeling and looking confident. She tells me over the last two years, she's seen the needs of her students grow. So she went to social media to see if anyone in the community would donate to her care closet. I mean, it blew up and I just am floored with the just love that our community has poured into our school here. Um, I put it on Facebook. I created an Amazon wish list. Um, just throwing it out there to see, you know, Honestly, I was ready to go out and buy all this stuff myself, but I was like, you know, I'm gonna reach out to the community and they delivered. Thanks to the community, all of these drawers are filled and ready for students next year. And food donations are especially important right now, and that's because as of right now, that free breakfast and lunch for every student is set to expire before the next school year begins. Working for you, Kelsey Anderson, WRTV. As someone needs to nominate her for a Jefferson Award, Brown has added clothing and school supplies to the Care Closet wish list. You can find that link to that wish list right now in our story on our website at WRTV.com.